In League of Legends, the Dorn's Blade, Dorn's Ring, and Dorn's Shield have been modified for Season 3. On today's episode of Wallmath, we'll be taking a look at how the items have changed and how this will affect their overall effectiveness. We'll start by taking a look at the Dorn's Blade. In Season 2, the Dorn's Blade costs 475 gold and granted 10 attack damage, 80 health, and 3% lifesteal. In Season 3, the Dorn's Blade costs 475 gold and grants 80 health, 10 attack damage, and will restore 5 of a champion's health whenever they auto-attack an enemy. This effect will stack with multiple Doran's Blades. Unlike the life seal of a Season 2 Doran's Blade, this effect will always restore 5 health, regardless of the attacker's attack damage and the target's armor. If we test a Season 2 Doran's Blade against a target with 10 armor, we can see that the attacking champion will need to have 183.33 attack damage in order to restore 5 of their health. If we test this against multiple targets with differing armor, we can see that the Season 2 Doran's Blade requires a champion to have quite a bit of attack damage to restore more health than the Season 3 Doran's Blade. Moving on, let's take a look at the Doran's Ring. In Season 2, the Doran's Ring costs 475 gold and granted 15 ability power, 80 health, and 5 mana regeneration. In Season 3, the Doran's Ring costs 475 gold and grants 15 ability power, 80 health, 3 mana regeneration, and will restore 5 of a champion's mana whenever they kill an enemy unit. This effect will stack with multiple Doran's Rings. In order for a Season 3 Doran's Ring to grant as much mana per second as a Season 2 Doran's Ring, a champion must kill an enemy unit at least every 12.5 seconds. This is very easy to achieve since at least 6 minions spawn every 30 seconds per lane and only take about 25 to 30 seconds to reach the middle of the lane. Finally, the Doran's Shield has undergone quite a bit of changes. In Season 2, the Doran's Shield costs 475 gold and granted 10 armor, 120 health, and 8 health regeneration. In Season 3, the Doran's Shield costs 475 gold and grants 5 armor, 100 health, 5 health regeneration, and will cause incoming champion auto attacks to deal 6 less damage. This effect will not stack with multiple Doran Shields. Obviously, the stats on the Season 3 Doran Shield are worse overall. However, let's see how decent the damage reducing effect is. Let's assume the champion buying the item has 20 armor. If the incoming physical damage is less than 195, the Season 3 Doran Shield will reduce more damage than the Season 2 Doran Shield. However, keep in mind that the Season 3 Doran Shield's damage reducing effect does not apply to physical damage from abilities or any source other than a champion's auto attack. The Season 3 Doran Shield may be useful against a champion whose main source of damage is their auto attacks and does not deal physical damage from their abilities very often, such as Udyr or Jax. Overall, the Dorn's Blade has become more useful in the majority of realistic game situations. The Dorn's Shield has become more of a situational item for countering specific champions, and the Dorn's Ring has become a very good item while a champion is killing minions. Make sure to like this video if you enjoyed it, and subscribe if you'd like to be informed whenever I release new videos. Click the annotation on the screen if you'd like to see the previous LolMath episode. You can also like LolMath on Facebook at facebook.com slash lolmathyoutube, and follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash trampolinetales. Thanks for watching this episode of LolMath.